mixed with? Sausage, biscuits, and gravy? Fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah, I see many videos. Uh, that was Alpha Gaming. That was from the Alpha Gaming channel. Shout out to you, man. Uh, but I couldn't find it on TikTok, so I had to use it anyway. This is the truth, man. The channel is the No Matrix. No Simping All Subjects channel. And the re <laughs> Oh, my goodness. The reason why I played that video, and I hope y'all could see it. You know, the sun kind of shining out here. But I wanted to play it on my other phone. The reason why I played it is because this is part of the Isaiah 4 and 1 series, and it goes in line with what I'm talking about. All the firing back that women is doing is disgraceful. And it's going to lead to Isaiah 4 and 1 coming to pass. In fact, as you can see, you got guys like Alpha Gaming that be lighting these females up with his reaction, just tearing them up, tearing them up. And it's like the Bible, like this is why no matter what they try to put in the Bible or take out of the Bible or no matter what was put in or taken out of the Bible, I'm always going to read it and I'm always going to know and understand that the Bible is prophetic. Isaiah 4 and 1 states, many shall in that day, seven women shall take hold of one man saying, we will eat our own food, wear our own clothes, only let us be called by your name, take away our disgrace. Now, she fired back on the guy in the video. Basically, the video was, he went up to a girl thinking she was white to shake her hand, and she told him she was mixed, and he backed his hand off to a nice beat, you know, kind of in line with the beat, and walked off. And the lady reacted to it, uh, Cause it said that the woman said she was mixed. The lady reacted to it and said, "What are you mixed with? Sausage and gravy? Get the f out of here!" And that was the video. <laughs> but listen, hey man, this is part of the disgrace, man. Y'all fighting back, clawing back. Y'all talking about. Guys being mixed with sausage and gravy. Y'all talking about guys having small wing dings. Y'all talking about guys being broke, being ugly. All of that's going to lead to the disgrace where you got guys like myself, guys like Alpha Gaming, and many, a host of many others just going to just kind of dissect your behaviors and the things that you put on social media. And it's, and guys are seeing this. So really y'all, a lot of y'all women are making it harder for the unicorns. I don't, I'm, I'm more uh, naywad. Not all women are like that. Just most. I think there are some unicorns out there but they're going to become harder and harder to discover because of all this bike back. Women trying to bike back. And you know, when two dogs fight, you know, you bite the strong dog bite back. He going to, it ain't going to like, it's not like he going to stop fighting. He going to bite you even harder, which is what we seeing on YouTube. Like you saying guys being monetized, getting uh, Ferraris and Porsches and brand new houses and everything because of what they say about these women. And if it, if it wasn't true at all, they wouldn't be able to grift. And I don't think all of them are grifters. I think some guys just want to help. I think some of them are grifters. This is how you know some of the grifters. It's July 18th. I don't know when YouTube money hit because I'm not monetized. But the, what the grifters going to do is usually once that check hit, you don't see them for five, seven, eight, nine, ten days. And then they come back once the money start drying up to make more videos. Then they disappear and wait for the check. Grifters. 
the ones that's not grifters that maybe they either they say okay yeah i'm gonna make some money off of it that don't make you a grifter trying to make money don't make you a grifter your motives make you a grifter the actions when the actions connect to the motives in a negative sinister way that's what make a person a grifter not a person that's ambitious and see an opportunity on youtube but I, I, you know, it's grifters on here. Cause look, a guy that cares about the well-being of these guys, he gonna make very frequent videos. You ain't, ain't gonna disappear for no two weeks unless something happened. Disappearing for eight, nine, ten, eleven days. Now here he come talking this stuff again. That's a grifter in most cases. You know, but nonetheless, what I'm saying is this, a lot of this bite back like that. She got him. She got a good one in. She got a nice little jab in there on dude. But guess what? Isaiah four and one is coming to pass because the attitude that led to that funny jab. I don't know. It's. Is she married or is she one? When we don't count passive dudes, punks, that, that don't ever st put their wife in their place or stand up to their wife. That's not a marriage. And we just consider that not being married. But most of the women is biting back like this on TikTok and they ain't married. Or are they married to a dude that just let them do what say whatever they want. That don't even count because you're not being a leader. You know, you. why do you need a woman to lead you? Like, you're a man. Why do you need a woman to lead you? But the bite backs are leading and are a component of the disgrace that's going to make guys minimize the value of women you can talk about how they look all day some of them same ones you talking about how they look gonna have six seven eight nine women they're gonna get tired they're gonna be like man why is it so easy no because it's gonna be a lot of women and what y'all doing right now and what y'all saying right now is gonna lead to nobody wanting to deal with you just remember that. And we can close this video. This is the truth, man. The channel is no matrix. No bowing down to women. No simping. Remember, being in the matrix, simping is hand in hand. No bowing down to women, man. The all this bite back that's going on, that's okay. It's all right. You know, it's kind of, some of it's kind of funny. Like that, that was funny. But guess what? Other guys going to see that and be like, man, she seemed like she got a bad attitude. A lot of guys going to say, I'd rather hump my hand than hump some of these 304s. Just really, that's the main thing y'all got to offer. And y'all beating that up with herpes. Y'all beating that up with, with you, you, you overriding it with all that slick talk. Get it together, ladies. Thanks for watching.